Hello and good morning or good day, beautiful people. Today it is Tuesday here. It's about 6.15 in the morning. I am getting, um, after I make this video, I will be calling a grab. I need to take these braces off. So I'm actually going to take them off now because they are like a distraction. They're so loud. Okay, you can hear the birds in the background. They're loud. <laughs> but anyway, so um, as soon as I finish making this video, I am going to call a grab so a, an uber so that i can um go to work so yesterday's recap oh my gosh yesterday was so busy i did not um capture any footage any video footage like it was just busy like it was just busy i only taught two classes yesterday the day was still crazy busy it was busy before school even started before i even got to school but um Again, I I have three roles within um, my position at my school. So currently I am managing, learning and managing the school's entire schedule. So that means like all of the teachers and stuff, um, their schedules, all of the classes that the school provides. I am responsible for, um, once I receive the information, I'm responsible for placing them in a classroom at a certain time and trying to ensure that nothing clashes. So that is um, one of my duties. Also the iPad coordinator. So there is an iPad program for a year, or you can say grade, year four through six. So those grades, um, they actually use iPads for their learning. So I am responsible for like updating iPads, updating apps, and handling password issues and things of that nature, how to incorporate um, the iPad within the, uh, within the program and within the classroom. And I also teach. So I had my first two classes of my teaching career, year one and year two. So that is very similar to um, in the US, grade one and grade two. Um, year two, my class, I actually had them, the birds are so loud. Like not only do I hear them this way, now I hear them that way <laughs> outside of my door because there's like an outside, a door to get outside that way too. But anyway, um, yeah, like year two, I actually had these students back in April, from April to June. So I had already uh, started, began teaching these students when they were in year one, but you know, they pretty much graduated. So now I have them in year two. So it was really good to see them up close and personal. Like some of them were like, I know you, I know you, you're Miss Rocker. Oh, hi, hi. And they're just adorable. They, when I tell you these babies are adorable, like anything that could have stressed me from my other roles, like, it's like they take it away. They take it away because they're just, they're just so amazing. Now, I will say, <laughs> kids will be kids. You know, I teach IT, so we're in the computer lab and um, they have Minecraft on the computer and these kids love Minecraft. I don't know if you know about Minecraft, but uh, these kids love it and they'll sneak and play it. And, you know, I already had to tell them, hey, no playing Minecraft in class, but, um yeah like they're awesome they're awesome they are so awesome i'm just thinking about them um so it was it was good to really put a a face to a name and a name to a face and up close and personal uh with year two because i've taught them before year one they are um i have not met them before so it was a um that was like a real experience into teaching excuse me i had to sneeze Excuse me, um, forgive me. So yeah, uh, year one, that's like grade one. They are um, less advanced. You know, some of them, they really do not know about computers. Some of them do, but some of them do not. So um, we did a, a, a paint activity and well, when I, when I first met them, then they line up. It's so cute how they just line up. The teachers tell them to line up. I come get them from their class. We walk up in a single file line. Like I've never taught. So this is like new to me. 
and I went to school like eight million years ago and like once I'm done with it you know that that's how I operate <laughs> but yeah like the one little girl she was in front of the line she was like I'm so excited I'm so excited like she was just so excited to have I ICT class and uh IT class if, if I say ICT it's information technology it's computer class okay guys ICT is equivalent to computer class but yeah like she was excited like I'm giving them high fives like they're showing me their work they're showing me their paintings and how they're doing and I'm like hey well share that with me tell me about it it, it looks great it looks awesome and they're all wanting high fives uh, year one, they are demanding. Some of those kids are really demanding. Teacher, teacher, I need you to come here right now. Teacher, I need your help right now. I'm like, okay, well, let me help right here and then I'll be there. And many of the students, they just got so impatient that they just walked up to me and grabbed me by my arm and started pulling on me. And that's something <laughs> like, <laughs> it's like, what do you do? So sometimes I'll, you know, I'll say, hey, Okay, go back to your seat. I'll be there as soon as I can. I'm helping right here, but I'll be there. And you know, if they are, if they can't get something right, I have one student that um, she she would have like a, a tantrum because she couldn't get it right. And I understand like when you can't get something right, it's frustrating. So um, that actually, it kind of like hurt me a bit because it's like, no, you don't have to get upset. Like you'll get it, just practice. And um, that's what I told her like, hey, we can do it together. Um, so that's something that I, the time and management and how to, in, in classroom management and how to manage each student and where to give my time. And that's something that I need to learn how to navigate because it can be a bit overwhelming. And then, um, there are some students that are way advanced and they're like, okay, what's next? And they want to play Minecraft. So, you know, that, that gets me thinking of how can I cater to all of my students? So um, first day was good. I, I met everyone, the, the staff, teachers, management, like they're so welcoming. Like they are just so welcoming. Oh my gosh, everyone was nice. Um, when I first arrived, well, let me, let me, let me give you, um, from my place, it's a straight shot. It's like 20 minutes, give or take. And, um, where my school is, it's in like, I guess you could say the country, what we would call the country. <laughs> because there's like city, there's like city, and then there's like country. But where my school is, it's like a village. But it's not like a, it's not like the village that you're probably thinking because you know, you're thinking like Thailand, they probably just have villages and that's it. Like this, where my school is, it's like an inter, it's, it's like a, like an elite type of village it sounds so weird but like if you were to go onto a resort i mean it's not like that like updated but if you were to go onto a resort like an all-inclusive resort and there are like different places and and like homes within it and stuff now it's not that elite but it i work at an international school and it's a private international school so um they actually pay to the um, parents pay for their students to attend. You have to apply all of that good stuff. So it's like a whole little community and village within that area. And it's, I guess it's amazing. It's huge. It's, um, there are different buildings to the school that you have to walk to. Um, the weather is really nice. You can see the mountains when you um, actually walk outside from the school. Like I, it was breathtaking to me when, um, before the morning announcements, this is getting long. So I'm going to wrap this up because I also have to go. But um, yeah, like the, there's so much nature around. I love the nature. The people are amazing. The kids are awesome. Yeah, I, I had a really good first day yesterday. I um, went to the mall, did some running around. I grabbed something to eat. I ate at a Japanese restaurant. That was really good. Like that mall is huge. But um, yeah, I'll try to, I don't know if I'll make a video today cause like I need to just catch up on some type of rest cause a sister is tired, okay? <laughs> but I just wanted to make a quick video guys. Thank you so much for your comments. I see you're, you're commenting, you're watching, you're liking. Thank you like that. That means a lot to me because again, sometimes it's hard to come on here and make videos and think of things to say and 
make videos when um I have a lot of work to do. So thank you so much, guys. Please continue to keep it up. I love when you have questions. I love when you have comments and feedback. So yeah, continue to do that. Share the video, you know, and um, yeah, I will talk to you later. Have a great evening. It's evening where you are. If you catch this shortly after I record it, um, if not, then enjoy your time, enjoy your day, whatever it is. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. It's not stopping. <laughs> Let's try this again. Bye-bye.